So it's still September 27th and I'm going to show you how to pack your green tomatoes away so that they ripen inside. Um, and Opie started eating the this one but uh, only on the stem so I can save it. But he, as soon as I brought these in from the other, not the peat bale row, but the other, uh, the peat bales in the driveway, um, he ate one of them. He ate one of these squash right away, just raw. It's funny how dogs love squash. I never would have known, but anyway, tomatoes. So you cover them over with some sort of paper. And really, you should put them further apart than I did, but I just, I'll look through them frequently, so I doubt I'll lose them. But if, if you put them where you space them apart um, more, so I'll take the orange ones out. I just want the green ones at the bottom. So if you space them out a little bit, then they're less likely, you're less likely to lose the whole bunch if one of them goes. But I'm, like I said, I'm not too worried about it because I check, check them every day or, you know, see which ones are ready. So I'll be just fine. And yeah, then you just put them, I put the biggest ones on the bottom too. And the, the greenest, whatever, but all of them are pretty green. So, um, and then, yeah, you just keep layering it up like lasagna. <laughs> tomatoes, green tomatoes, and then paper. And uh, until you're all through with your basket.